now we are going to see numbers chapter the world of numbers the world of numbers students take page number 57 and in this lesson we are going to see how to compare numbers and arrange numbers in order in about roman numerals then how to explore different system of numeration now it's time to get it into the topic so here what is a value depicted by a number what is a value depicted by a number what is mean by depicted it is nothing but represent so see here i will write one example 9 and 8 now what is the position of the number 8 it's in the units place and what is the position of number 9 it's in the tens place so now can you say what is the value of 9 it's 90 so the value depicted by a number is 90 what does mean by pep uh, students do you have any idea about pep it's nothing but preparatory enrichment program preparatory enrichment program it helps us to recall our previous classes now students take page number 58 in this page see here if one more ticket is sold if one more ticket is sold the number of tickets sold will become what so that's your question so what is 9 plus 1 it's 10 so carry over 1 and what is 9 plus 1 10 again so here 0 and again 1 so 0 then again 1 so we are getting 10 here so in your previous year you have studied about 10,000 so in this grade 5 we are going to learn about up to lakhs place so see here how many digits does this total have how many digits it has so let's we count 1 2 3 4 5 6 so it has 6 digits so below this 99 plus 1 equal to 100 999 plus 1 it's 1000 9999 plus 1 it's 10000 see this one question is given what pattern do you see here plus 1 here also plus 1 here also plus 1 so what is this plus addition so i have written already here as addition pattern so here 100 here 1000 and here 10000 10, it's also called your increasing pattern fill in the blanks to extend the pattern so here 9999 we are going to extend this pattern so after this we are getting 99999 and with this if you add plus 1 what will be your answer it's 1 lakh here 10,000 and here it's 1 lakh. So see the next one. It's 9,99,999. So with this if you add plus 1 we are getting 10 lakh. Like this we can extend this pattern. So next. How many digits do these numbers have? So how many digits it have? So see here. 1, 2, 3 and it is 6. So write as 6 in the dash. So next number has how many digits? Yes, it is 7. In this grade 5, we are studying about lakhs period. And it has lakhs and 10 lakhs. Already we know, by putting together 10 groups of the previous place, we get a new place in the place value system of number. Mm. So if we put 10 ones together, we will get 110. So like this, if you put 10, 10,000... 10, 10,000, it will make 1 lakh. So, I am writing 10, 10,000. How many 1 lakh will make 10 lakh? So, it is 10, 1 lakh. It is 10, 1 lakh. So, we use commas to separate the period of lakhs, thousands and ones in the numbers. Why we are using commas? To make it easier to read the numbers. Page number 63.2. So, here they have given periods. Using this, we are going to form the number and number name. It's 29 lakh 47,002. We are going to write the number name now. Twenty-nine lakh forty-seven 
thousand two. Remaining sums you have to do as a self work. And what is the system called? It has lakhs, thousands, and ones. It is called your Indian system of numeration. And this also you have to do as a self work. So continue with the next page sixty one. Using the place value chart, answer the following question. So see the first question. Which place is the digit eight in the number? Eight in this number. It's fifty eight lakh two thousand. Three hundred one. So eight is placed in which place? Lakhs place. So it's lakhs. Now, what is the face value of the digit eight in this fifty eight lakh two thousand three hundred one? What does mean by face value? It is nothing but the digit itself. So the face value of eight is eight. Now come to three point three. Complete the table with the face value, place value, and place of the digits colored in red. So here some digits they have colored in red. So see here first sum already they have done for you. Let me see that thirty eight lakh fifty six thousand four hundred ninety one. Here what is the face value of eight? It is nothing but the digit itself. So it is eight. Now what is the position of eight? It's in the lakhs place. And what is the value of the number? So they have written in the numeral form. So let me do it one for you. Now see this number twenty seven lakh thirty thousand five. Here two is coloured. Now what is the face value of two? It is the digit itself as two. Now what is the position of two? It is in the ten lakhs place. So now we will write the value of the number. So it is written like this as twenty lakh. Remaining sums for yourself work so complete it. Hmm. See here, we are going to do three point four. Complete the table by writing the number form or expanded form of the given number. So see the first question they have given in the number form. We are going to write in the expanded form. What is write expanded form? Writing the number according to their place values. So it is ninety two lakh fifty six thousand three hundred twelve. So What is the place value of nine? It is in the ten lakh. So I'm writing as ninety lakh. What is the place value of two? It is lakh. So I'm writing here as two lakh. What is the place value of five? It is ten thousand. So I'm writing fifty thousand. Now what is the place value of six? It is thousand. So it is six thousand plus it is the value of three is hundred. So three hundred. The value of one is ten. So plus ten. Then at last the value of two is in units place, and it is two. So next they have given in the expanded form. We are going to write the number formation. So for writing the number formation, we have to start from the uh, highest place value. So I am writing as ten lakh because here fifty lakhs is given. So it is fifty lakh. Plus six lakh. So in the lakhs place, I am writing six. Then it is forty thousand. So here I am writing as ten thousand, and here four. There is no thousands place. So for thousand, I am writing zero. So in the hundredth place, there is two, and there is no tens place. So here also is zero. Then there is units four. Now you just you insert the comma. It is fifty six lakh forty thousand. Two hundred four. Here I have done two sums, so remaining sums are your self work. Do the self work and post it in WhatsApp.